It's almost Easter time and with the weather still sort of mixed, sort of coming from late spring into Easter right through into the early days of summer, I have a variety of lovely handy recipes for you. These are going to be cooked up with Smart Living and Normandy and they're recipes with a modern day twist that will be suitable for everybody. Leg of lamb, so traditional at Easter time, but this is a modern thing to do with your lamb. Into some foil with that to start off with. And then I'm going to cover it with a variety of simple things. A little bit of chilli sauce, a little bit of sea salt, paprika, black pepper, seasonal herbs, I'm just using a little bit of thyme. And then I'm going to cover it with soft brown sugar, sprinkled over the top, a little bit of balsamic, dot around the outside to keep it nice and moist while it goes off to the oven to cook. Now I'm going to pop this in the oven at 200 degrees centigrade, that's gas mark six. That's really quite high. And I'm going to put it on the middle shelf and leave it to cook nice and slowly for about two to two and a half hours and then which you see what we're going to do with it. This has been cooked in the oven really nice and slowly with all that lovely lamb. But just a couple of nice things to go with this one. And they just simply take their lamb, whichever dressing you fancy, you can just put a little bit of it over the top and off you go, comulating and simple, all cooked up. Simple cakes is a traditional Easter cake made with a lovely layer of marzipan in the middle. But I've got a quick way of doing this cake which fits in well with people being in a modern way of baking. Starts off with butter, sugar, eggs and flour creamed in the bowl and then to that all the other ingredients simply go into it. The secret I think in any cake is to get your fruit nicely steamed, sultanas and raisins and the cherries, steeped in a little bit of sherry first of all, in they go and then along with all sorts of other lovely ingredients. We've got a couple of ounces of ground almonds. The spices are mainly nutmeg, but a little bit of mixed spice and cinnamon. A little bit of lemon, a little bit of vanilla, all going in. All mixed together, as easy as that. But here's the difference in this cake. Half the mixture goes in the bottom of the tin. On top of that, you put a layer of marzipan, which you can roll out, but this is the easy way of doing it. I chop it up into little chunks and scatter it over the top. And then over the top of that goes the remainder of this, and then off to the oven to cook. I pop this mixture into a seven inch tin um, and I'm going to cook it in the oven at about 325 degrees Fahrenheit. That's about gas number four to five and it's going to take about two to two and a half hours. You know when it's cooked because it'll be nice and firm on top. Middle shelf of the oven and again, it's a Normandy oven so it's easy to keep your eye on it. You can see how it's cooking nice and clearly through the door. There we are, really risen and golden. Just leave it to cool in the tin for a little while before you turn it out and it'll come out for you nice and easily. And once your cake's cool, you can decorate it with whichever way you like. Traditionally, this cake is decorated with marzipan on top. Oh, but it's also lovely, those lovely little fresh flowers, the little violets, the little daffodils, just around the side of the cake and all finished off with a go for traditional Easter cake cooked in Normandy. Whenever I'm cooking at any time of the year, I like Romandi appliances because they give me the quality, the reliability that I want. Whether I'm doing a leg of lamb, an Easter cake, or just home baking in the kitchen, they give you that extra guarantee you're sure it's going to turn out right. This is a very simple scone mix, made with flour, a little bit of egg and milk, all mixed together. And in the bowl, I'm just going to add to this little bit of egg and the milk and just mix it together until I've got a nice stiff dough. Don't make it too soft, otherwise it gets quite difficult to work with. It takes a moment or two just to get this all to mix together. Then when you've got it together, just turn it out onto a floured board, dust it with a little bit of flour, roll it out to a rectangle about 10 inches by 8 inches. Doesn't have to be too exact because these just are rather fun. And then now that the filling is nice and cool, we're just going to spoon this over the top, roll them up and then cut them into little rounds into a tin which I've lined with greaseproof paper. It's a spring form tin which will make it easier to get them all out. So just put them round in a circle, round they go, nice big one in the middle of it. Dust it with a little bit of demerara sugar and off to the oven to cook. Convenience seems to be one of the buzzwords that we have today. And it's not just about food. 
It's about the way that we do things. It's about the balances that we have in our home. And again, this is one of the real important things with Normandy, the continued new technology, making life easier for people like myself and all of you out there. I'm going to combine recipes with the technology that Normandy have. And I've got a great recipe for the kids this Easter, or even right through into the summertime. I've got a lovely recipe here for little lemon muffins. I've also made some little biscuits as well, but it's really how they decorate them up but let their imagination come together. This is where baking has moved on. This is just a recipe where everything goes in the bowl together and you mix it round. It's got butter and sugar in the bowl. I'm adding to that the eggs. You don't even need to beat them, in they go. In with the flour, in with the ground almonds, in with a little bit of lemon, a little pinch of baking powder, and as well as that, I've got cake making self-raising flour. So all of that going into the bowl together. And once I've got it really nice and smooth, then just into little bun cases, and there's so many fun ones of these that you can get. You put them into a preheated oven about 375 degrees Fahrenheit. That's about gas five to six. And these will only take about 12 to 15 minutes to cook. And then when they're cooked, bring them out of the oven, leave them to cool down slightly. And there you are, look at that. So with a combination of the technology and the modern approach of Normandy, with new modern baking methods, you've got a real success this Easter.